Well, up next, Mr. Bishop, it's actually a very important event. It's a contract signing between Mr. Robert Weilager, Rocco, yeah. and of course, no gimmicks needed. Out, Jace being preceded over by our lovely Moody Star. Uh, well, let's get it to Pete, get the ball rolling, and see how this turns out. <laughs> Uh, Pete? Pete! What, come on, Pete. What are you doing here? And now Thank for you. Two words. The WWE president, ugh. Maurice Star. What do you mean, ugh? Acting president. No, Acting. she's the official WAW president. When that happened? Always. It's Moody Star. She's always president. Look at her. She's beautiful. She's gorgeous. Look the at best them. looking vixen in WAW history is the lovely Moody Star. Yeah, you just like changing her boots for her. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, Chaz, I need to get you the uh, handkerchief. You're drooling a little. That's from the stroke, sorry. I don't want to know what you stroke when she's around. I don't know, every time I see her, I kind of picture a Coke bottle. I'm thirsty hey, now. Nice shorts, Rhett. Let me send you a copy of the uh, referee um, handbook. Yeah. <laughs> I don't mind that. Anyway, for those of us who are adults in this building, what we got coming up right here is an official contract signing between two wrestlers. Nothing unusual going to happen. The wrestlers and myself will be signing the contract. Nothing out of the ordinary will take place. Am I right? Am I right? With the signing of this contract, we will officially have our match. Between Rocco and Alex Chase. And Hellbound. Pete, why don't you just uh, help me out? Bring them out. Hold on, let me turn it on for you. Don't touch the microphone. I'll hand it to you. Don't grab it out of my hand. Take the mic from him, please. Oh, and Rocco, it would be a good idea to uh, not bring the lady friend. Ooh. Yeah. Meow. Huh? Just call someone out. All right, all right. Call Alex out. Mr. Jace. That's good. Good job, Brad. First into the ring is Alex Chase. Yeah, Mr. No Gimmicks Needed, who I noticed has been milking that arm. At, whoa, ooh. What the? Well, he's bringing a little insurance policy with him. That is not a little insurance policy. Smart thinking by Mr. Jace. Holy mackerel. All right, that ring has been weight tested, right? Yes, yes it has. It can fit everyone's ego and then some. Not yours. I'm thinking more of the mass of Little Italy. Little Italy in the ring? Sorry, I was paying attention to Miss Star. You're a focus, Chad. The other part of this oh, yeah. contract is Rocco! Oh boy. That's the sound of your life going down. And Rocco, none too happy after what happened to Stolina. And none too happy at Alex Chase, considering the time twice now he's had powder thrown at him from him. And Rocco ready to go. Now before we get this started, would either of you like to say a few words? I know you have them still in you. I hope 
he shows up. First of all, Rocco, you need to invest in some breath mints, all right? I got to go over here. No, and second of all, you have to beat me in order to get some type of garbage wrestling that you want. You know, you have to actually beat me in a real wrestling match, you know, unlike you doing your little pumpkin crusher with like a chair on your knee or barbed wire in your fist and touching yourself or something. What? What the hell does that have to do with it? I have a book though. You make no sense as it is. No sense though. You know what? You talk about being hardcore, Rocco, you are not hardcore. You wear a stupid pumpkin shirt and you go around saying, oh, I'm hardcore because, uh, you know, I could get hit by a car and, you know, that's not very hardcore. That just means you're lucky. And I think you're, uh, you're, your luck is run out. My luck run out? I don't know if you heard my catchphrase, but at Hellbound, tick, tick, tick. That's the sound of your life running out. Ooh. It just sounds like you have a, you know, a case of Tourette's, you know. Tick, tick, tick. Oh, he's a fun guy. Did you learn that from Chad Epic? Are we going to sign this thing or not? I didn't know you could read Rocco or write for that matter, so go right ahead. <laughs> he turned the mic off on you. Rocco, can you read? Read it then. Alright? Yes, read it. No, with a microphone, not to me. Yeah. Head up, keep going, stick a little head. Shut your face. Now you know, Rocco, that if you uh, if you touch me after you sign that, it's gonna be void. You didn't read it, Rocco. I'm gonna read this one. Now, this following contract declares that both Robert Rocco, King of Queen of Violence, two time WAW champion, two time. Uh, who cares? Yeah, actually, you know what? I just want, I just want to talk about myself. See, Ugh. what it says essentially is that you have to beat me not once, but just about twice. Just to, you know, get your little hardcore match, okay? You gotta make me, you know, pin me or make me tap out, but you have to definitely make me tap out in that second match, okay? You know, uh, the last two times we met in this ring, I broke your hip and I, I injured your shoulder. Ooh. I hate to say it, but he's right. Mm-hmm. Now, one question for you, what the hell, what the hell is a Boston Master match, okay? Just, Explain this to me, like, yeah. What is that? I respect you a little bit. I will explain. See the Boston Massacre match. Are you ready? We hang whatever we want. Any weapon. I don't care what it is. It could be a taser. It could be barbed wire. It could be thumbtacks. Hell, it could even be Moody Star and hanging up to throw a weapon. <laughs> you have to climb a ladder. You get that weapon. And you gotta make sure your opponent is eh, probably knocked out or between us, we'll probably kill each other at that point. Yeah. And you gotta use it on them to get the victory. Oh. Don't you realize, Rocco, that by going into this hardcore wrestling bullcrap, no. that you are ruin ruining this wrestling company. You are ruining the wrestling world. You are messing up these people's minds out there. Oh, Although their minds weren't that great in the first place. Shut your mouth. Hey, Rocco. You know, I don't know if the match is going to be next week or the week after. I'm still not clear to wrestle. So you know what, Rocco? How about this? Oh my God, he's finally signing it. Let's give him a pause. All right. All right. Looks like we are ready to roll on this.
make this official. I'm pretty sure you're getting booed right now. I think we are. The contract is signed. Now that the contract signed, that means I can kick your ass right now. Whoa, here we go. And whoa, uh oh. Wait a second. Wait a second. Hold on. This are no gimmicks needed. And, oh, come on! Using that injured shoulder, though. That is the not powder. injured my, injured my butt. Oh, wow, Rocco getting choked out. Oh, no. Come on. And look who came up. Miss Delina is at the entranceway, but there's really not much she can do. But Moody Star will whoop you if you need it too close. Well, Moody Star getting out of the way, and oh my god, just broke Rocco in half. I like that. That was good. That was no, entertaining. No, no, come on. End this. And wow, wow. give me a break. Well, Alex Chase has some higher muscle here. Muscle? Are you kidding me? And you can it's smell that stuff up here. It smells like ugh, Japanese salt. Ugh. Well, this stuff is Chase. thick, thick with powder and salt. It's just disgusting. Oh no! Oh no! 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 Stop this, Pete! Come on, Johnny! Somebody, stop this! Yeah, Selena, do something. Stop Come this! Come on! No, Selena, stay out of the way, honey. Be violent! No, Be the no. queen of violence. Do something! Stop the violence! And wait a minute! And, whoa! Hold on! No! God, no! No! What? Oh my god! Oh come on! Practically breaking him in half! I think he might have just broke his throat. And Stalina being forced to watch. This is ridiculous. That Rocco can't see. Headbutt! Oh no. Gotta oh, be kidding me. Even with one arm, Joey Staples is better than Rocco. Yeah, and with he's got six foot, practically Alex seven Chase, feet of 300 me. pounds of muscle. I don't see 300 pounds of muscle. I don't know what you're talking about. Literally, literally he is not getting involved. Oh, come on. Alex Jay's trying to do some damage. He says, oh, Mr. 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 No Gimmicks Needed, No Hardcore. What's he doing right now? What is he doing? He's a hypocrite. He's, He's a beating hypocrite. up Rocco at Using his own game. Using what? And wait a... Oh, no. Where is Jace? No. No. Yeah, that's Alex, Jace, number. come on. Mr. Jace. No. No. God, no. God, no! Oh, my wow. God! Breaking the neck of Rocco. And that is... Actually, I mean, that was... Oh, my God. You know what? Rocco very much asked for the Lord of the Ultraviolence to be taken out. You really need to be careful what you wish for. You just might get it, Mr. Bishop. Well, Rocco, I'm, I'm emailing the, the paramedics downstairs to tell them to be get ready. We got incoming. But Rocco... Oh, God. You're right. He did get what he wished for. And hopefully he can return the favor in the coming weeks. Tregarbo, green hair and all, man. I saw that out there. You got close. You got lucky. Went up there with Gino and Crochet. They almost had you. Listen, Gino Diomedes, he's unlike any other competitor you faced before. Yeah. You faced a ton of them. Yeah. From CVZ to Rocco to Carnage to Michael James. Don't forget Todd Sopel. I can't forget Todd Sopel. Unlike anybody you faced before. I'm just saying, prepare for anything. Thanks. It Thanks, Mike. Appreciate it, buddy. 
Rock home. Flash is right. Tonight could be your last night with that belt. Good luck, buddy. You know, it means a lot coming from you, Rock. It means a lot. Hey, and uh, from the champs to the champ, uh, good luck. All right. I'll do what I can do. Hey, just in case we never get a chance. You know it. Go down, Troy. Good luck, buddy. Thanks, guys. The following contest is for the WAW Big Sims Championship. And we'll be deciding the single snatch rules. Entry first, the challenger. Hailing from a sucker Japan, it's Tala Hayden! I really think it's her time of the month. She is pissed off and raging. Oh, I'm sorry. Seeing your little sister win a title, win the Tavixen Championship, then get it robbed from her and beat down by Bianca Wild. No, no, that's got nothing to do with it, Chaz. Shut your cake and just watch her get to the I ring. really don't think the that challenger. has anything to do with it. I think it's her time of the you, month. You don't think. That's your point. Yeah, there's no filter. Now, the Alley Cat is on the prowl. And she wants gold. And still favoring that knee a little bit, I notice. Entry second, the WAW Big Suits Champion. Hailing from Atlanta, Georgia, is Bianca Wild. However, as geared up, as the Royal is, she's still got to go through Miss Twisted Steel and Sex Appeal, the baddest bitch on the block, Ms. Bianca Wild. Curves in the Autobahn. And here we go, Vixen's Championship on the line. Delilah Hayden got gold in her sights as well as a little vengeance. And last week we saw her dishing out a bit more of a beatdown. Oh, well, this is for the Vixen's Championship. And Delilah Hayden, like I said, oh wow. Oh my God, look at her go. Unloading on, Del uh, on Delilah on. Yeah, try to say it three times fast there, Chaz. Sorry, I'm just actually kind of impressed by the mean streak on Delilah Hayden. Now, as I said, Alley Cat is on the prowl. Making me sweat a little bit, actually. Oh, oh, right on the knee, returning the favor. Actually, the ankle. Whatever, it's part of her leg. I'm not paying attention anyway. Well, you should be, because Delilah Hayden taking it to, to Bianca Wild. And I think Bianca, if she thought she was going to get out of this one easy, if she was going to be able to take down her like she took down Trixie. Oh, oh wow. She's got another thing coming, and speaking of coming, incoming! Oh! oh big splash on Lady one, 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 two! Kick up of Bianca saving her championship. And Bianca taking the powder. She needs a water. She, needs, she uh, needs a break. Chaz, come on. Miss Wild, you, you look thirsty. Here you go. Oh, sure. Yeah, you want to give her that? Yeah, she looks thirsty. You're not looking at her throat. Oh, oh, come on! What? No, but I'm thinking about it, Mr. Bishop. Oh. Oh, oh, no. Throwing in now. There we go. Bianca Wild turning the favor with big lights and left. Oh, choking, choking her. her out. Those big boots of hers just crushing her throat. And Bianca Wild proving why she is the original wild child of the day. Oh, no. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. Oh, God. Right on that ankle, the injured knee that she... Uh, Tore apart uh, Newton. You're not even paying attention to what body part they're hitting. That's so the you know knee. what? They're hitting the knee. And Bianca setting up. One, two. Kick out as Delilah fighting for her life now. Well, Delilah, I mean, she's not fighting. She's fighting for her honor. She's for, I mean, I'm. Oh, oh wow. Raised in the army with her parents down in Japan. They've been all over. We're in Japan longest. All right, her sister's out, still in traction in Mass General. And wait a minute. Whoa, wait, hold on. It's oh, a guy. Big Insiguri to Bianca Wild. Delilah Hayden hurting herself there. I would call this a cat fight, but since we've got the alley cat and the bitch in the ring, 
This is more like cats versus dogs. One, two. That's not very nice. Neither is Bianca Wild. I know, that's what I love about her. She's an evil, evil bitch. Now, meanest champion we've had, as I said, our original Wild Child, and now Delilah back in the corner, and Bianca, head of steam coming in. Big splash right there, using the chest to her advantage. Go ahead and say it, Chaz. What? Boobs. Yeah, there you go. Thank you. But no, wait a minute. Oh, tries lock to lock in, in the apology. Oh, wait, my. Miss Lethal Laura, wait a minute. DDT, the Dance Dance Twirl Illusion. And one. 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 Whoa. Hold on, Lethal Laura oh, Harris. Smacking Johnny Psycho. And now. Getting just, thrown into the brutality wall there. Delilah Hayden thinks uh, she won the match, but she doesn't see Lethal Laura Harris on the outs. Oh, she knows she's How did she, now. yeah, how did she miss her? Oh my God, you gotta be kidding me. Into the brutality wall again. Holy mother of God. The Montreal monster is bashing. Lethal Laura oh my Harris, God, damage but, control. Oh, hold on. Bianca thinking she's got the victory. Oh! Holy mother! Just laid her out, and she just laid out the Vixens champion with one big back elbow. That's a big elbow. If you girls didn't hear, Lethal Laura is here for the belt. Oh my God! Well, if you want to make a statement here in WAW, first taking out Stalina, then. Well, I'm just going to assume that this WAW Vixens title match was a no contest. No contest because the one who did win and sent the statement first was Tolina, then with Ann Morenci, and now Bianca and Delilah taken out. Oh my God. Referee has ruled this contest a no contest due to outside appearance. Oh. Ah. Interference? Well, I got tr freight train coming through. Well, not only does Lila Hayden now have a problem with our Vixens champion, she now has a problem with Lethal Laura Harris. Uh, I think Lethal Laura Harris isn't isn't doesn't have a problem with making problems with people. Where's what was uh, that about? Yes, yeah, Champa got taken out with one shot. Well, you know what? We gotta take it backstage with the champion Troy Garbo for the main event tonight here on Aftermath. All right.